welcome back. Welcome to Louder Louder! Woo! As you can see, alone ako tonight, pero I won't be alone in a very long time because we're just waiting for my partner. Joyce, kung mo man to, you can do it. <laughs> Kaya mong lumipad. I swear, kasi traffic along EDSA ngayon because of the reblocking. So, damn you! <laughs> anyway, welcome to Louder Louder and we've got our special guest today. But before that, I would like to talk about my partner's music video launch last weekend. Well, see, si Ange and Pao is there. And I heard na sobrang daming fans ni Joyce pumunta. And I've seen uh, the video also for, from Joyce, of course. It's her latest single. It's entitled Tulala. So if you want to check that out, you can search it on YouTube. <laughs> Tulala, di ba? And he, she's always tweeting about it anyway. But I heard that the event was a success. Yeah, congratulations, Joyce Spring. I am so proud of you. Legit singer ka na talaga. Well, singer ka naman before, pero ngayon singer ka na you have your own song and album and everything. So congratulations. And we will talk more about that later on pagdating niya. Uh, but for now, of course, our guest for today is the awesome yes, and gorgeous bikers from Globe. You will see them in just a short. I'm sure lahat ng mga guys na nanonood dyan, is aabangan nila yung mga guests natin because they're all gorgeous and sexy and athletes and everything. Yes? <laughs> and we have two bikers from Globe and they will going to be inviting you on their latest event which is the Cordillera Challenge 5 and it's a scenic 65 kilometer ride from Tublay to Kapangan in Benguet and back. And of course, Globe is inviting you, their subscribers, to join their advocacy for environmental sustainability. So let's give it up for Glow for that wonderful project. Hashtag project wonderful. Okay, and you can also use uh, their hashtag for the event. It's hashtag GlobeCordy5. All right. And I'm pretty excited about our guest for today. Because our usual guest kasi is, is music artist or mga... Artists, talaga, like uh, like our guest uh, last time, comic artist. But now um, we're taking on a different route. I think more athletic, ano? So magpapaka athletic kami ni Joyce mamaya, kasi mga bikers yung interview namin. Kaya namin to, and syempre yung ano palang namin yung yung built palang namin pang athlete na kami ni Joyce. <laughs> da, sobra. <laughs> Yeah, I'm pretty excited and syempre parang promoting girl power din because our bikers are gorgeous women. Ayun, nasa tabi ko kasi sila ngayon so tinitingnan ko talaga sila. But yeah, I'm still waiting for my partner to arrive. Don't worry because Joyce will be here joining us as well for today's episode. But for now, since we're live streaming again, yay, you can check out our episode www.nmftv.com And with that, and with that, of course, you can also follow us on Twitter as well for the latest updates about our episode for tonight. That's at Louder Louder PH and at NMFTV and at Amplify PH as well because it is also an Amplify.ph podcast. All right. And don't forget to like us on Facebook as well. Yes, we have a Facebook account. That's Facebook.com slash Louder Louder. And for New Media Factory, that's Facebook.com slash NMF TV. Or NMF only. NMF TV. New Media Factory. Oh, yeah, and my social media accounts. And with that, you can also follow me on Twitter. That's at Nikki Viola underscore. Again, it's not my old Twitter name. It's not Nikki K17. <laughs> oh my God. Because I'm going to tweet sahin. With my with my old Twitter account, which is very high school and very JJ, that, that's Nikki K17. But I changed it for louder, louder. <laughs> yes. <laughs> but recently, ko lang siya, mga, mga feb ko lang ata siya. So anyway, it's Nikki Viola underscore now. I don't have an Instagram account. I'm I'm a loser. I know. Sorry. <laughs> but I'll yes. But. Yes, there you have it. So, more of uh, our guest later on uh, from Globe and more of my partner, Joyce Spring, later on, only here on Louder Louder, so stay tuned. 
during and after what happened sa Yolanda, seeing everybody helping out each other, that's what really made sense to me. Since I'm a fashion stylist, I would always want what looks good together and finding the pieces that would look great together. I think for us as Filipinos to get up and mobilize to help other Kababayans in need, that's natural to us. But for us in this case, to never give up and never get tired. Whatever your job is, it doesn't matter. During that time, we just all went there, helped each other, and moved the world. gravity of the devastation, I just, I don't know, there was something inside me that just felt like nothing else in my life mattered. I worked very closely with Gawad Kalinga. I was so happy that Globe chose them too because as an organization, I feel that their love and care for the people and the communities is something that I don't see enough. You know, I just find that that was the most special one for me. It's a good feeling, especially when you know when you're helping some other people, especially when you see them so happy because they're going to have a new house, new home. It also means that we're showing them that we're involved, that we care, that they're not alone. executives were here today. And on the ambassador side, it's me, Liz, Morris, who's a new ambassador. Well, it's an eye-opening thing. Through activities like this, it just goes to show how much commitment GLOBE has to, to this effort. See it for yourselves and participate, spend a few days here and help build some homes. The Globes Project Wonderful is all about creating a wonderful world for our consumers, our businesses, as well as the nation. It's the sort of the way the Globes putting together all of the building blocks we've built over the last four years. Remember, the wonderful world includes the nation. And so we also want to make sure that people who are underprivileged, people who have been devastated by the typhoons, also somehow in their own way live a wonderful world. I think everybody can help. In our own little ways, we can help just by tweeting, using social media, and using your voice. Walang iwanan in the sense that we're here when we start laying out the bricks, when we start making the bricks, when we filter the sand, when we paint the house. But also, more than that, it's restoring the dignity of the people that have lost so much. This whole experience reminds us that nation building can be as simple and meaningful as lives you're building. And when we do things that exceed what is expected of us, we create wonderful. And yes, that's wonderful. Please do watch us at www.nmftv.com and 
I will welcome our special guest for tonight, our lovely bikers from Glow. So, introduce yourself, ladies. <laughs> I'm Carmela okay. David. Um, I'm the program lead of Globe Cordillera Challenge 5. Wow. And? And I'm Vanessa Estrada from Globe also. Um, I tried our, my first party event last year. And yeah, so yeah. participant and a forest builder. Wow. So you're, 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 you're bikers, right? So do you have a team at, at Globe? Talaga? How many are you? Or parang kahit sino lang talaga pwede mag join or you have your or or you have your own solid team talaga on your company but well, in my case we're a group of well, we're triathletes in in the company so we're like a varsity team since a part of wow. that sport is also biking some of us really do mountain biking so they're they're now joining majority of us are joining this year. But I know there's a club, the Bikers Club. Globe, Globe Adventure Bikers. Club. It's and Globe Globe Adventure Club. The Varsity Team. Yes. yes. <laughs> the Varsity the Team. So you're part of the Varsity Team, both of you. I'm both part of, of Globe Padiak. It's the main biking group in the company. So. Uh, so athletes, too much. Guys, tigan yung ah, sa sexy nila sa manta ng ako. Kailangan ko magan. Del, ano na. Sige, mag, mag cover ako ng konti. <laughs> well, anyway, um, as we said earlier, you have your event this coming May 10, right? And yes. it's Cordillera Challenge 5. Can you tell us more about that? So, the Globe Cordillera Challenge 5. So, it's not a race. It's a personal timed event. So, mm -hmm. the main mm -hmm. advocacy is uh, to showcase the scenic um, environment of the Cordillera Mountains, which is the place that we're trying to protect. Mm -hmm. So basically it started out as um, the executive director of Cordillera Conservation Trust wanted to to get more funds to protect these mountains. So he gathered his friends to bike for 24 hours. So our one of my colleagues, my our my supervisor, found out about his story in a magazine and then they contacted him. Hence gave birth to the first Cordillera Challenge, which engaged around 70 bikers only. Way back in 2010. 2010. So, so you've been on it for like five, five years, years already. So, okay. so right now, ilan yung bikers na mag participate for the challenge? We're expecting 800 bikers to join this year. From 70, From 70. now it's 800. Yes. Wow. So. But it's biking lang, no? Kasi like what you said earlier, try athlete kayo. So hindi naman siya yung... No, no. Just biking. Just biking, just biking lang. <laughs> <laughs> Grabe. How <laughs> about yung ganun? Like you like... M mountain biker, you're also a mountain biker. Yes. yes. So you get ganun talaga yun. Like, pag sinabing biker ka or cyclist, tama ba? Or it's a cyclist, different thing. Cyclist, it's a different thing. I think it refers mainly to road bikers. Road, uh, road bike. Ah. <laughs> so aside from aside from Globe, you have this organization na kasama niyo with this. It's the Cordillera Conservation Trust. They're our beneficiary. So sila din yung who help help us organize the event. So, so you, you work hand in hand with them. Yes. And you're and I'm sure you're you're very excited to work with them again this year. Am I right? Yes. Yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 I'm very excited. <laughs> we'll know more later on. Yeah, but of course, um you've been with with biking, you, you've been training for this for quite a long time. So how how long ba do you train for this kind of challenges? For well, the event is on May, mm -hmm. so usually the registration starts March. March. Yeah. So by then you should start training once you're registered, because uh, you're yun eh. uh, <laughs> so you can't back out. Uh, so what kind of training do you do? Like, since it's ano lang naman, it's it's six five uh -huh. kilometers is long. Okay. It's so 65 long? from like Cordillera kilometers, not Manila kilometers. Okay. So Cordillera it's pataas. Yes. Uh, Rolling with trails and, and road and fire bako, bako roads, na. yes. And you're girls and you're doing it. Oh my God. <laughs> I can do it also. I, I, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> well, the training, you don't really need to do the 65 kilometers when you train. Yeah. Just, you know, 20 kilometers every weekend or you do the cardio, the regular cardio that you do so that Running. you know that you can endure 65 kilometers is four, four to five hours. With so stops. Yeah. So, so and from you know right that you can 
you can finish it. Yes. Then you should, of course, you should be comfortable with the trail. You know how to make turns and use your brakes. It's not that easy. Yes. yes. So, like with, with you guys, you started training when? Uh, do you train together or you train on your own? Train, train on our own. own. Since yeah, you have your your job work schedules or yes. different. So. Business. You have to <laughs> balance <laughs> work and. I'm really sure. Oh, okay. So, so now with, of course, with the challenge, how can uh, the non-bikers support this event? So we mentioned that we're also raising funds uh, for the reforestation of the Cordillera uh, Mountains. So non-bikers can support by a gift launcher. They can visit www.giftlauncher.com and just click the Cordillera Challenge page. They can see that profiles of the teams there and the individual profile. So it's easy. You just link your Facebook account mm -hmm. to the gift launcher so you can create your um, gift launcher account also. So you have <laughs> modes of payments, either Gcash, um, bank deposit, or via credit card, or if you have PayPal. So, ah, okay. So you have, um, you have teams and there's individual bikers also. Yes. There's 800. Yes. Because I imagine ko eh. lots of boys, so imagine. <laughs> so that's the challenge, especially for all of our ladies out there who yes. wants to get fit. Since magaanan ka, sobrang since ano na since mapet niyo labor and date tapos na pala labor ra kayo. But still, if you're if you're training, if you're going to train for this, you're training within the week of ano labor ra kayo magi fit kayo, di ba? And the bottom line is, <laughs> my boys talaga. Because yes. I was asking the kanina, sabi nila, I make cute, make cute boys. Actually, may pinakita sila sa akin kanina. And this guy is part of. He's, the, the, he's the executive director of the beneficiary. Uh, he's the one that we are talking about. So, mm -hmm. would you mind? <laughs> <laughs> or the photo lang of the. Uh, no, 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 wala, wala. Tinatay, tinatay. So may parang nilaglag ko ata siya. Baka hindi na niya ako. Hindi na siya ako pensin and after. <laughs> well, aside from our bikers out here, uh, the rest of the Globe team is also here. Say hi! Hi! hi. Okay. Okay, so now aside, uh, I know that uh, you've been really busy with, with the Cordillera Challenge and and with your job. So aside from that, how, how do you balance it with of course, aside from your training and work, how do you balance it with your personal lives? Personal lives. I'm business. I'm I'm business. 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 I'm since it's 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 kind of hard. Like you, you work for for Globe, of course, and you're also training for the team, and of course you have your own uh, social life or personal life. So how do you balance it? For me, well, I'm lucky because my husband also does what I do. So we both love biking, we both love swimming, we both love running. So. We do, we, our dates are basically, we okay. sleep early and we wake up early so we can bike. So that's it. So that's a whole day event already. Then we don't anymore, we don't anymore, <laughs> well, we don't anymore go to the movies or we don't anymore go to dates. So you it's just buy. basically, that's the, the thing that we do. And um, yeah, well, what else? <laughs> I see the no, And then, but, Actually, the training that we do, it's not really that's it for me. It distresses me, it recharges me. Um, some people think that why don't I rest mm -hmm. or after work, why don't I just sleep or you know, stay at home? Mm -hmm. But basically, for me, it's it's really recharging, it's it it's takes out the stress just 30 minutes every day and every weekend, just have a new place to go to. That's, and that's you're with your special someone, so that's yes. Uh, we share it. We share the same thing that we both love. And I heard also that there's this proposal. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, with with you and your Anna. So how did it go? Napakalabo. That was last year. We were talking about it kanina, like uh, before the show, and we we're planning to really talk about it on air. So go. <laughs> <laughs> it 
it was actually our 10th year anniversary as my <laughs> friends and girl. <laughs> 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 so May 3, May 3 is her annum. So, there, actually, we have a lot of reasons why we joined Cordillera. Well, number one, of course, it's He's one thing. He's part of it that, also. Yes, he joined also. He by. One. So, one thing, of course, is to join the advocacy. I mean, it, it, the environment is one of the um, advocacies that we very, very much support. Then second, it's another thing to bike in Cordillera. I mean, not everyone can bike there. Yes, I mean, not yes, everyone yes. has access. Yes. And then it's a Globe event. So when I support Globe, I give everything. So I asked my, well, at that time, my boyfriend. So it was her 10th year anniversary. So that's the fourth reason. <laughs> and then the fifth, of course, to travel. I mean, it's a, I think it's Labor Day, so it's long weekend. So we're there. So I... I got into a bike mechanic problem during the race, so I ended so late that it, it really crushed me actually. But the, the fact that I finished, finished it, it's, uh -huh. it's very traumatizing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> if, if you knew what happened, it, it, was, it, was, it was the hardest race I've done actually. Mm -hmm. And it was my first time. Every time I finish the race, it's, of course, a highlight of my trip. So whenever I talk about it, hey, I finished the race and I'm so happy. But it was a down moment because mm -hmm. I really had a hard time finishing it. it. So when we had dinner with my family, that was the time that he proposed. So I realized that... that day also? Yeah, wait. same day, that same oh. night. So I realized oh. that if I finish the race with a nice time and then I even probably won something. It would be the highlight of my trip. But I guess there are reasons why things happen because big be mechanical problems really happen to me. So that proposal it's maybe it's a, my it's, a, no, it's, a, it's a premonition. Premonition new yeah. idea. Yeah. It's, it's, it's a sign that mm. something's better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. something's better. Yeah. Something, something better was planned. Uh, so what, what's your reaction? Super no, 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 no. shocked. I didn't expect Although it was her 10th year anniversary, I didn't expect that that was it. Nah. What? Yes. <laughs> yeah. I haven't had a decent boyfriend. <laughs> I'm just kidding. You know, never know when so it's special to you talaga. So, yes. Um, I think mas naging special pa yung biking sa Yonalok because of that. Yes. It's yes. a very That's memorable right. Cordillera. Guys, See? you know the drill. You know how to, <laughs> you know how to propose. Okay, so more of our uh, gorgeous globe bikers and their personal <laughs> lives and their cheese <laughs> uh, right after this short break. So please stay, stay there. Yes, yeah, so we took a plane over to Armagh, and this is my first time. Thank you. People are so friendly, they made me feel so welcome here. The people in the township were beautiful and, and maganda. We um, visited with the kids in the town. Just the beauty and the innocence of the kids. It just went a long way for me. It touched my heart. And I love children. And just to see them, you know, these big open smiles, that can go a long way. Kids are beautiful. We are very happy to um, share with her our small token of appreciation. When we went out there, we helped a small business owner at her Sorry Sorry put up a sign, and she told us her story. And to see that she's back up on her feet, working and building her business, that was very inspiring to me. Salamat, 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 salamat. With all the devastation, you know, a smile can change a moment. It sounds cliche, but I think it's true. What we've done is actually give them a retailing package wherein we further increase their capability to earn. What we have given Manang Bising was a mobile phone, a retailer SIM, and a seed money or a startup money that allows her to sell loads. To the mobile number, the amount of loads. I think it's a natural instinct for all of us to help out along the way and give back. Global Telecom has been an incredible partner with me in terms of allowing me to raise awareness about what they're doing as well. And I saw what their mission is in nation building, culture building, and brand building. And I thought, you know, this is a really solid vision. Well, first off, I learned that the strength of the Filipino people is paramount. And 
even with all the challenges that have come their way, I think they're back up and very positive and hopeful that their towns and cities are going to rebuild, and it's inspiring to see that. One big smile, smile, smile. I think, you know, programs like Project Wonderful is something that's huge here. Coming out and building homes and sending materials and sending um, financial aid is always just an incredible thing. I think, you know, throwing money at the problem is one way to go, but, you know, what Globe Telecom is doing is they're inspiring small business owners to get up on their feet on their own and have the responsibility of running a business. And I think that there's something to that as well. It's very inspiring. They say nothing in this world is free, and for the most part, that's true. But here at NMF Network, all shows are indeed 100% free. And as an added feature, you have the option to subscribe to all your favorite programs, also at no charge. Why should you subscribe? By subscribing, you no longer have the hassle of delays when you stream the program. You also don't need to keep checking our site to see if your favorite programs are up because they'll automatically be uploaded to your device as soon as it's available. Here's how to do it. First, open iTunes. Your next step, hit the iTunes Store button. A search bar should open up as soon as you do that. Type New Media Factory in the search bar and all your shows should open. Pick the show you like, or all the shows you like. And once that opens, hit the subscribe button. And that's it, you're in. All shows will now be automatically downloaded to your device. Welcome back to Louder Louder! <laughs> and we're still here with our guests for today, Vanessa and Miel. Mayelina. <laughs> Miel of uh, Glow. So again, thank you so much uh, for being here. So again, uh, we are reminding everyone that um, this event is not just a race, it's also a, a fundraising activity. Yes. So maybe you can tell us more about the uh, fundraising part of the event. So as mentioned earlier, uh, non-bikers can support by the Gift Launcher. So Gift Launcher is a startup project by Kickstart. So it's the um, incubator solutions incubator of uh, Globe Telecom. So mm -hmm. this uh, small group who uh, had this um, innovation that they we funded. So now we're giving inviting everyone in the public to use this platform. So yes. as mentioned, you can link your easily link your Facebook account. So it's easy to get your friends informed also about the advocacy that you're supporting. So mm -hmm. in this case. Um, the friends of the bikers are actually informing their friends also <laughs> that they're supporting or um, believing in this uh, cause. How, what's, why it's it important to protect our environment right now? So they can um, donate pledges. to anyone <laughs> through pledges. So then, as yeah. yeah, as a biker, you can raise funds through pledges. So mm -hmm. you can ask your colleague. So your colleague would actually need to sign off um, a waiver that they would get from their salary <laughs> at this date. Mm -hmm. So any amount will do. So as long yes, as you raise funds. And then of course, again, you explain why 
um, you're raising funds for every kilometer that you do. So that's 65 every kilometer. kilometers. Yeah. 65 kilometers give me this amount. I'm just so, kidding. So can they choose, uh, or it's ano, strictly up. 65 kilometer lang, or they can choose na if it's 15, 20. Depends. You won't finish it. Oh. You won't finish it. Ah. Mm. Okay, There's a finish oh. line. Yeah. But uh, if joining this, talagang strictly 65, ano yung, tatapusin talaga. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Pero yun, um, it's effective right now. We got around one more than 100,000 uh, funds raised already. And that's only on, ano lang, diba? So few friends, second degree ng friends mo. So imagine, Getting your friends, yes. yes. So, wow. diba? Ang laki nun, in fairness. Yes. <laughs> so. Grabe, but, um, but with, with, with this naman, like, um, aside from the, the challenge itself, what else can we expect during that day? Or are there any mini events? Are there mm -hmm. raffles or something? Mga ganun. So, the event, we actually employ locals also. So, the marshals are from the local communities. The food on the trail are prepared by the local communities. So we'll be able to to taste the local delicacies there. Mostly these are uh, rice delicacies. And, and then rice like oh, coffee, 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 coffee also, also of, Cordillera of course, coffee Cordillera the coffee. Best. And then part of the trail uh, will feature. Uh, siguro, it's not familiar, but there's rice terraces in Benguet. Oh, yeah. So, dadaanan yun ng mga bikers. It's a ano, very exciting route. So, even, siguro for the non-bikers, you can visit before or after. You can follow the trail. So, mm -hmm. the route of the event is available naman dun sa mm -hmm. Facebook page ni Cordillera Conservation Trust. So, you can just follow the route to see what the bikers uh, will see during the event. So, either you can visit it before or after. So, Ayan, it's not it, the usual places that you'll go to when you're in Benguet or Baguio, the strawberry fields. Yes. Ano. So, it's yeah. one way of um, traveling. Talaga. Pretty exciting. Ayan. So, so how, um, what, what's the difference of uh, this latest Cordillera challenge to your past challenges? Naman? Mm -hmm. um, what do you think sets it apart from the past year? So we mentioned aside from the distance, okay. so we started <laughs> with the um, very short, about 20... 2010, no? 20, 2010. Yes, around 30 kilometers lang yata when we started in um, 2010. And then, of course, we try to feature different routes. So, iba-iba talaga siya every year. It's so, it's not, not the same. Ah. It's not the same Kapangan, Tublay. So, before, it's going up to Santo Tomas. Mm -hmm. If you see the, like, the big... It's the highest uh, point in Baguio. Ayan, so, so Baguio, if, you've, uh, if you've joined one... You can't say that, oh, I don't want to join already because I've, I've seen, seen it, the, you know. the same route. But since it's different every year, you want to join every year. Mm -hmm. You'll be encouraged to join yes. every year. So different pictures, oh. different scenes. Yes. Wow. All and of course, um, yun, aside from the from the rules, you'll be able to meet the communities talaga that we're supporting. So, you can interact with them mm -hmm. also. You can also the schools where the roots and shoots, mm -hmm. these are the seedling nurseries, uh, the schools that host the seedling nurseries. Doon napupunta yung funds that we raise. So we try to integrate um, the establish, establishment of the seedling nurseries sa curriculum ng mga kids. So we engage the kids, the parents, the teachers, and the barangays in building this nursery. And then sila din yung nagpapalaki, sila din na magtatanim. So it's actually changing the mindsets of people in the community na ano yung um, how can we start uh, mm -hmm. diba? protecting from our own? So, yun. I think it's good that you get to experience the culture of yes. Cordillera as well. Uh -huh. Aside from, of course, having fun and getting fit and all that. Yes. At least, parang you'll get to learn to the locals talaga on how they live. You can see it yes. sa mga sa trails pa lang and you can interact with them also. Mm -hmm. So, mga stopovers yun, no? Yes. Ah. Mga water stations and mm -hmm. food stations. Food stations. I think this year the highest is close to 1,800 meters above sea level. Wow. That's so, so big. <laughs> and that's only the first part. Oh. Like 30 kilometers, you still have 30 mm. more. So both of you are, 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 are going to be there also to yes. buy May 10 will be so there. Are so are you ready? <laughs> Are you ready? We will be ready. We will be ready. Kung halimbawang mag-join ako, hindi ba, is it too late to trade? Because <laughs> it's me. <laughs> Pwede <laughs> naman. Kaya 
Kaya pa naman. Magawin na lang, ano na, like, everyday. Siguro, ganun na yan. You can, ano, mix it training with running, ganyan, just to build your endurance. Ah, it's not just biking for, ano. Kasi for for try for cardio yes mm-hmm. you need cardio <laughs> and then the air there is different because you're up yeah. I mean the, so it's, it's cool. thinner it's, yeah it's thinner it's harder to breathe so you have to practice <laughs> that also but me palang na feel sabi ko sabi ko talaga sabi niya it's harder to breathe feeling ko talaga well and then north 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 ba siya? So, yes. North, so, pampabagyo. So, sobrang curious ako kasi I'm not good with with places talaga. So, I know Cordillera. I, I've heard about it. But, you know, I, I don't know the exact places. Mm-hmm. So, sige. I'll, I'll, I'll ask my athlete friends. <laughs> yes, I have athlete friends. <laughs> athlete friends for that. But, of course, you have, oh, you've invited your, you've invited your, your close friends as well. To this. So, marami naman yes. na nag-join, di ba? Yes, a lot. Like, 800 na yung... 800,000? Di naman. 800. 800 lang. We will be damaging the... Ah, uh, okay, okay. So, okay, okay. So, now, um, again, we have here our guest uh, from a globe, Vanessa and Miel. Thank you. Thank you so much. And, don't fret, we'll be back. Yes, we'll be back after this short break, so stay tuned. Hi. They say nothing in this world is free, and for the most part, that's true. But here at NMF Network, all shows are indeed 100% free. And as an added feature, you have the option to subscribe to all your favorite programs, also at no charge. Why should you subscribe? By subscribing, you no longer have the hassle of delays when you stream the program. You also don't need to keep checking our site to see if your favorite programs are up because they'll automatically be uploaded to your device as soon as it's available. Here's how to do it. First, open iTunes. Your next step, hit the iTunes Store button. A search bar should open up as soon as you do that. Type New Media Factory in the search bar and all your shows should open. Pick the show you like, or all the shows you like, and once that opens, hit the subscribe button. And that's it. You're in. All shows will now be automatically downloaded to your device. What show? That show! It's a show! You know, all that show! It's that show, buddy. Oh. That show! Oh! Yeah, that show's cool. We talk about. Oh, 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 what does this look like? Vagina? And. Like a double blowjob! Vagina? Who is the asshole that decided to shave this shit off the entire planet? Sometimes we like to talk about. It's like when you guys like high-fiving on a girl and then you're doing her in the butt and you're doing her in the mouth. High-five, bro. Vagina. Vaginas. And you're jacking off really intensely but like massaging your balls and shit. I'm not talking about a Chewbacca, man. I'm just talking about a nice little, you know. Vaginas. And don't miss that spot, like the cowper's gland. It's like in between your balls and your asshole. But not me, because I'm a guy. Yeah, that's a cool show. You should watch it. I, I think we're on on Tuesday. Vanessa and Miel of a Globe. So now again, this is your chance to invite everyone for the Cordillera Challenge. On its fifth year. Go. So everyone, we invite you to help us raise the hundredth uh, seedling nursery or the house of the s- seedlings. Um, we invite you to visit giftlauncher.com backslash globe cordy five. So you can just link your Facebook account and then you can also add us. Um, on Facebook, Globe Bridging Communities and Cordillera Conservation Trust for updates about the event. And then you can, for 
Twitter, please add us also, Globebridge.com. And then, mm-hmm. and hashtag, hashtag, use the hashtag Globe45. Yes, it's on our screen so then, also, hashtag yes. Globe45. So take note of that. Again, thank you so yeah, much thank for, you, for sharing uh, everything about your event and sharing your personal lives as well, your yeah. proposal <laughs> and your love life, guys, nice. and the love life of each of you <laughs> yeah. here. Thank you so much. I had fun listening to your chismes and everything. Yes, yeah, so, so once you. again, again, we would like to thank our guest uh, for today. Thank you so much thank uh, for you. being awesome. game and for being here. And for those of you who haven't watched our episode live, you can check out our episode tonight via our website. That's www.nmftv.com. And uh, you can also follow us on Twitter for latest updates. That's at Louder Louder PH and at NMF TV. Again, for our Facebook as well, we have facebook.com slash Louder Louder PH and facebook.com slash A New Media Factory. And don't forget to follow Amplify PH as well on Twitter. That's at Amplify PH and facebook.com slash Amplify PH. Again, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Again, Joyce, I miss you so much. <laughs> I'll see you next week. And yeah, uh, what else? Yeah, do follow me on Twitter, NikkiViol underscore, and uh, my partner's Twitter account as well, at Joyce Spring. And do support her latest single, Tulala. Uh, you can Google, you can Google it, or you can you can type it on YouTube, and there's her uh, latest video. Again, thank you so much. Thank you. And I'll see you guys again next week. This has been louder, louder. Bye bye. The views and opinions expressed on any program are those of the persons appearing on the program and do not necessarily reflect the views and opinions of the New Media Factory. Some programs on this network might include strong images and language and may not be suitable for all audiences. Viewer discretion is advised.